every Miami police officer has one now. They look like vests. We're talking about body armor designed to keep the most dangerous bullets from killing both you and the officer during an active shooter situation. In part two of our exclusive series, Hatzovella takes us inside the Pompano Beach factory where these lifesavers are made Check and tested. So that paper rolls on top of the fabric. It's similar to a clothing factory, patterns and all. All different brands of fabric. 1,200 workers at what is said to be the largest manufacturer of soft body armor in the world. Pompano Beach based Point Blank Armor runs a seven day operation. This is inspection, counting the layers. What starts as a fabric is then sewn. But equally as important is the testing of the vest. So this is our research and development uh, lab here in Pompano Beach. It's a lab few get to see. People's lives depend on it, and so it, we take that very serious here. Which is why it's all done methodically. We want to have the same rate of speed. We want to be able to increase the rate of speed and test the armor to its limits. So this is the fixture. We shoot anything from a 22 to a 50 caliber in, out of the fixture. These chronographs here capture the speed of the bullet as they pass through. This is one of the popular vests that keeps the bullet from penetrating the officer's body. Take a look here because this clay is used by researchers to show what kind of impact the bullet has on that officer's body. We're going to take a look with testing right now. And we're reproducing um, the velocity of the rounds. So they're going to fire from here. Wait, so what kind of impact are we looking at here? So the round impacted the vest and was stopped by the vest, and the clay is only allowed to be dented up to 44 millimeters. In terms of injury, what are we talking about? A very severe bruising um, and some soreness. We take a look inside the vest. You can see the point of impact. And underneath multiple stopped? layers of materials, we find what's left of the bullets. Well, this, is, this fiber that they use in this material, this ballistic material, is stronger than steel. Back on the floor of the factory. Checking everything before it goes out. The work continues to get it all delivered. The orders are coming from around the country and the world. And these folks continue to test different fabrics with different stitch patterns. The goal is to get the lightest, thinnest, and most comfortable vest that stops the rounds and keeps the officer alive. In Pompano Beach, Hatsovella, Local 10 News.